years ago, 40 years ago, this week, the Hare Krishna movement in the United Kingdom became a registered charity meant for service to this country. It is still recognized by the British government as a charity which is fulfilling its purposes of uplifting human society by the teaching of religion and the distribution of food, which I think you have experienced a little bit tonight. Now with us tonight, we have 1,700 of you. Some of you are up here in the gods, and some of you are here. 1,700 of us have gathered for this remarkable event, 300 of whom are serving. 300 service bringing you right inside. Spirit. It's this spirit of service which keeps the Hare Krishna movement intact. This spirit of service keeps people coming back for more so that they leave our temples with their heart uplifted. They learn, they become inspired, and they become strengthened to take on the challenges that ordinary life shows us. Now one person who knows a lot about the challenges of looking after such a place is the temple president of the Soho Street Radha Krishna Temple. Oh yes. Save it, save it, we'll leave lots more later. You will not be surprised, dear brothers and sisters, to know that in the 40 years there have been no less than 27 different temple presidents caring for Sri Sri Radha and their community. That's just how challenging it is. And our current temple president, he's been doing a wonderful job for three years. So now may I ask you to be very, very noisy and give it up for the man who's organized this wonderful festival tonight. He's going to go with our And the Troxy this evening has become like a jewel box full of valuable, invaluable jewels, gems. I'd like to thank all of you for coming this evening and making this a wonderful, wonderful event. I'm so inspired to be here and be with all of you. I can only say that it's incredible standing here and seeing how many devotees have come. Forty years ago, Srila Prabhupada came to London, and the Times of London printed one article that said, Krishna chant startles London. Srila Prabhupada explained, if he had come to teach what we had forgotten, and that was love for Krishna. I would like to take this opportunity to especially thank those guests who are here with us of the original six pioneers who came to London, brought the dream of Srila Prabhupada to the English shores, we have with us Shamsandra Prabhu. <laughs> Malati Prabhu. 
Zenuda Tulu and Gurudas Tulu. I would also like to thank those two of the original six who are here with us in spirit, but were unable to make it in person this evening. That's His Holiness Mukunda Goswami Maharaj. We are greatly indebted to your years of service and your dedication and inspiration. Thank you so much for being with us tonight. Thank you.